Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing and review video and I'll be opening the Casio F91W watch. So we have the watch uh, right here and this is one of the most popular watches in the world if it's not the most popular watch in the world. So a lot of you probably have uh, memories with this watch when you were little and I recall uh, going back as long as when I was probably grade like seven, eight uh, or nine to you know see this watch uh, everywhere and people are wearing it. So this watch is still exists today and uh, nothing has changed much except that you know uh, we have a watch which has survived uh, the time and it's a very good quality watch and a really uh, cheap price. So. We're going to be opening this up and then take a look at it but before I do that let me just go over some of the specs right here so this is a F91W1 model and the watch has a time alarm stopwatch and calendar so this is a resin strap and case adjustable watch and uh, the battery life is really long it can last up to seven years but I heard that you know it can last even 10 years uh, there were like you know many people uh, who told me that you know the watch lasts about uh, 10 years a battery and even uh, this uh, cheap watch is water water resistant uh, which is 50 meter uh, good for shower swimming and even like you know uh, going up to 50 meters uh, deep and then uh, the watch first came out in uh, 1989 and uh, according to Casio they have like you know three million uh, per year uh, manufacturer they've been manufacturing three millions per year so look, this is a really popular watch and still you know survives today and then uh, the watch is uh, barely 21 gram uh, you would not even feel like you're wearing anything and uh, many uh, you know famous people have been known to uh, wear this watch and one of them was uh, Barack Obama uh, so uh, you know he was seen uh, wearing this watch as well and in terms of dimension, so this is a 34 millimeter diameter, and then this is uh, in terms of depth uh, 8.5 millimeter, and the lug is 38 uh, millimeter. So I'm going to just set this aside here, and we'll take a look at the package. So the watch came just like this. There's no fax, fancy packaging or fancy boxing. Uh, that's how you know they can keep the cost low. Uh, depending on where you are buying from, um, in Canada you can get this from about below $20 uh, and you know if you're in the US or UK probably you'd get it for like you know, around $10 or so 10 pounds. So this is really inexpensive watch but that doesn't mean that this is not a good quality watch. So the plastic uh, package is uh, like you know very cheap and minimal and that's what's expected and then uh, we have uh, the model number right here which is F91W and then let's uh, you know uh, remove this from the package and see what it looks like okay I'm surprised that they even attached a uh, brochure or manual with a guarantee certificate and this looks like a like you know uh, thick one there's lots of lots of information here so they attached here this is the warranty card and here this is the register online to win something and then here is a small brochure or instruction manual Okay, and then here we have a, actually, actually, I'm sorry, this is the instructional manual. The other one was just probably like a you know, warning and other stuff. And then this one looks like the instruction manual and our user guide. And they have added actually a lot of information which I'm not going to go through. Usually I never read them, uh, so I'll just put it aside. So I'm surprised that you know they spent some money you know pr uh, printing these for this you know cheap watch so we'll just leave it uh, here and the box is empty and here is the watch you were looking at okay so the first thing I'm noticing that this is really tiny uh, you know when 
I was looking at it uh, I didn't feel this is going to be so tiny or small and the resin strap actually feels smooth and on the back of the watch we have some information for example the model number and stainless steel back water resistant so it's just you know some basic information and here we have the watch so just to uh, you know show you uh, the comparison of the watch and its big brother which is I think almost the same watch but in stainless steel cover which is this one uh, this is a different model and I have reviewed this one in the past which will be in the description link uh, box below but you can see that you know they're very similar except that you know this one is stainless steel and this is all uh, plastic or resin but uh, you know this one even doesn't look that bad this one is slightly more expensive than this but still this one is cheap one okay so let's concentrate on what we have so yeah this is just you know even smaller than I was expecting and then we can see there are like you know three pushers right here two is here and two is here and then we have time date and the watch was just uh, still running I uh, didn't uh, you know turn it off for anything and then there should be a light right here so let's see okay so it's gonna be hard to see because of the light but uh, you can see that you know even they have a like in you know, a small light here to see it at night so when the watch came out in 1989 uh, there's no like you know LCD or uh, back lead or anything but still they were able to produce this watch with the technology or with the materials which exist uh, still exist today and then uh, the operation is very simple you have to just like you know set up to set up alarm you just keep pushing the pusher and then if you still keep pushing it then it's going to be the stopwatch and then this is going to be the like you know time setting and if you just keep moving then it's just going to like you know come in that order and then here we have AM PM function so it's going to be uh, you can make it like you know AM PM or in the for format of 24 hour or 12 hour and then I heard that if you press this for a few minutes and if it shows Casio here that means it's a genuine Casio if not it's a fake Casio so I'm gonna just try to see if this is just work it works or not so I'm gonna just push it here and actually yes you can see that it turned to Casio so that means that this is a real Casio but I have a feeling that you know the people are the uh, those who are making the fake watch uh, they can still copy that you know functionality so just press it here and it shows Casio here so I don't think this is that kind of foolproof but still it's not bad so I'm just going to quickly wear this and see how it feels like so here I am uh, you may not be able to see it very well due to the lighting condition but this is how it looks like on my wrist and it really looks like you know I'm wearing nothing so it feels very comfortable uh, it doesn't feel bad at all and the resin straps are they're kind of soft not too hard and it just like you know it would I think it would match with anyone's wrist whether you're like you know you have small or big uh, arm or if you're male or female uh, this is kind of universal watch uh, if you're like an adult or kid so this watch would fit on everyone so let me just uh, take it off so in terms of you know what you're paying and what you're receiving uh, this just doesn't make sense that you know you can buy buy something for so cheap and it also doesn't make sense you know this watch is the world's most popular watch and has been surviving since 1989 that's just you know uh, mind-blowing because the cost has gone up so much since those days and there are so many like you know uh, new materials improvements of other things and the, so many watch companies but still this is still like you know surviving and this is still the most popular watch in the world
So I have seen, uh, you know, uh, female, uh, male and kids wearing this watch too. And when I was little, uh, then, you know, I have seen like, you know, uh, lots of students were wearing this watch because this is probably the most inexpensive watch at that time. You know, uh, if you would look at like, you know, uh, like 1989, 1990, 1992, that time, I don't think there were any other company, you know, producing watches uh, this cheap. But now they're like, you know, cheap watches everywhere, made in China. Uh, but that time, this is one of the most accessible watches uh, at the time. And this is what you'd see, like, you know, if you uh, go to a watch store or supermarket or anywhere, they're just like, you know, in the, uh, in a, like, you know, rotating uh, shelves or something. Uh, which anyone can buy and afford and the surprising thing is the price hasn't gone up comparing this is 1989 when it first uh, came out and still people are loving this and you know wearing this watch today thank you for watching this video uh, I have some more watch reviews video which I'll put in the description um, box below and just to mention that this is not an affiliated or paid review. All my reviews are non-affiliated, unbiased and honest. So there's no affiliated link to click and I'm not going to make any money off you. So thank you for watching up to now. Uh, forget about subscribing this channel. Forget about liking this video. Uh, there will be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly.